the new year kicking in, Red Bull continues to give wings to people and ideas. Until now there hasn't been a single major sport event without Red Bull's actual involvement in it. Whether it's organizing an event or offering sponsorship, Red Bull has been an omnipresent brand in the popular culture. Motorsport, off-road racing, music festivals, esports, space diving, and the list could go on and on. There are tons of upcoming events on their website. What do all of them have to do with the energy drink? Right, nothing. The newest Red Bull event that targets university students in particular is Can You Make It 2016. The idea is to gather a team of three friends and travel across Europe using Red Bull cans as only currency. The participants will have to hand their phones, cash and payment cards at the starting point in Prague. Teams are expected to rely on their bartending skills and charm to trade Red Bull for everything they need on their journey. Sounds awesome, doesn't it? What Red Bull applies here is a very smart marketing technique, the goal being of course not to show people on your social media how much fun you have traveling, but rather to show them how much fun you have consuming Red Bull. If you read through the terms and conditions of the event, you will notice that participants are to share their adventures on their social media profiles in order to achieve points and continue the race through Europe. The more popular a team becomes on social websites, the bigger the chance of winning. Now, before embarking on the adventure, the teams have to upload a one-minute video based on which they will or will not be selected to enter the official run. Where's all your stuff? All we need to say, Fuji, are three things. Red Bull, passport, and your votes. All right, let's go. Take a look at a few shots from the videos that were uploaded for a similar challenge run by Red Bull. The people in the video appear as interesting, funny, and adventurous. Their life seems intense and colorful. Does drinking Red Bull really make you seem more interesting? Remember we concluded that the actual energy drink has nothing to do with music festivals, racing and diving? Well, it has. Red Bull marketing techniques work by associating the energy drink itself with a certain lifestyle. Tailing the ideas of youth, sport, and adventure to the Red Bull brand. This is why, by traveling through Europe using Red Bull cans as currency, one does not necessarily promote his or her adventure, but rather support an aggressive but well thought technique to sell products. Red Bull's Can You Make It Challenge starts in April and 165 teams of students will launch on the adventure of a lifetime. Are they aware of the fact that what seems to be an adventure is an actual scheme to sell products? Going on an adventure is so much more than indirectly advertising goods for some big guys up there. And guess what? You don't really need money to travel. There will be links in the description to a few articles that explain how actually to travel all around the world without trading cans of Red Bull or spending money. It's quite simple, only if you have the courage to take such a leap. For now, thank you for watching this video, spread it around and don't forget to subscribe to my channel. There will be a lot of curious stuff uploaded here soon. Also, there are a few facts about Red Bull in the description of this video that you might consider interesting. See you soon.